I just wanted to make a little video of replacing my iPhone 6 screen that broke. And the amazing thing about this is it's Sunday and it's Amazon and they delivered it uh, today. But wait till you see the size of these screws. I can't even describe them. Uh, so I'll let you take a look and see what I'm doing here because I really don't know what I'm doing. This is trial and error. Okay. Okay, this is the box that came in. Nice looking box. And here, I want you to look at these screws. Look at them. Look at these things. Uh, here is the screwdriver that comes with it. <laughs> Amazing. Here is my uh, iPhone screen. You can see it's all busted up. The only thing that's holding it together is the, that plastic cover I put on it. Well, you're supposed to put this thing on it, pry up the edges, and then you open it up like this. And you take uh, you take five screws out of this area right here. Then you take this off. Now, I can't even really see these with a magnifying glass. But there's three cables there. They snap out of there somehow. And then, here is the replacement, which looks pretty simple. Some of these come, it's called a digitizer. That's the cover there. Uh, but this is the digitizer with the case. There's your little plug-in plug cables. You can look and see how small. I can't imagine how they mass produce these uh, with these small components. So once I get them three hooked up, uh, I replace the screen and hopefully uh, it will boot back up. We'll test it out and see. Well, there it is. All done. Charging it, new screen, and they also have what's called a glass screen protector, which is kind of neat. It's like putting a thin piece of glass on it. But it was very tedious, and the biggest problem was in darn little screws. That's the smallest screw I've ever seen in my life. They're hard to even see, let alone use. Okay, got lucky.